and Julianne with Pineapple Papers, and it is the Secret Not So Secret Kit Club Day, and we are doing an unboxing of my October November kit, um, and it's based on the two Pink Paisley collections, again and again, and truly grateful. So Christina is always super awesome and sends a sweet little note, so I will read that separately. And then it's always wrapped in some tissue paper. Um, so of course I am a hoarder of all tissue paper if you have watched my channel for any amount of time. <clears throat> so today is no exception. I will leave a link to Christina's shop if you are interested in getting your own kits. So these are curated um, to your style and your specifications, your amount, how much you want to spend. Um, so I just give her an amount that I want to spend. Um, and sometimes I do it every month, sometimes every other month, sometimes I do like um, like, uh, too many kits. So all kinds of options, which is super awesome. So I'm going to set these bags over here for Julie Ann because she loves that part. And then I am going to start with the papers. <clears throat> so this is Pink Paisley again and again, number two. And then this one is from Truly Grateful, number 24. Julianne really likes that one, of course, because it's rainbow. I think I have a fun idea for that one, actually. Um, this one is Truly Grateful, number one. So a super awesome cut apart sheet. She knows how I love those, because um, this is like added embellishments and layering and awesomeness. This one is the cut apart sheet from again and again. So this is number one. I like both of those. So this is number 11 from again and again. Fun little rainbows. This is number 20 from Truly Grateful. And some birds. I think I'm definitely going to use that side. This one I have seen like, I mean those fussy cutters out there, like I have seen this paper fussy cut and I'm not sure I want to take that on. This is page 10. Ooh, yeah, maybe half, I don't know. Yeah, but even if I did a diagonal, I would still miss out on some of the colors. Hmm. Okay, that one that one needs some major thought. This one is page number five from Again and Again. No. And that is super fun and busy. That make your eyes go, ooh. <laughs> so this is Truly Grateful number eight. This is another one of her awesome, <laughs> and Julian's giving it a thumbs up. Um, I don't know what you call it, but it has all the patterns, all the colors. It's so pretty. It is too. Yep. Um, and I struggled with the one from Horizon, and then it's like one of my favorite layouts ever. So, be interested to see what I decide to do with that. This is really cute too, though. And this is Truly Grateful number 16. This is like Sarah's paper because it is all mushrooms. And then a nice stripe on the back. Then this one is again and again a number eight. So a nice floral and a fun oh. geometric. <laughs> uh, truly grateful number five. Christina knows th that I have an addiction to paper. So lots and lots of paper for layering, that type of thing. If you're a minimal paper and you do lots of of embellishment she can totally take care of you there too so I'm kind of a more is more so I use lots of everything um, and the last paper is from again and again and it's number 12 
Mm. Really love this color. Okay, so I got some thickers. So I have the again and again puffy thickers. I'll show you both these. Julianne loves it. And then I have the puffy thickers from Truly Grateful. Super excited about these. I definitely wanted these. And then I have the 6x12 sticker sheet from Again and Again. So my plan with this kit is actually to do our trip to Mexico over fall break. And um, I know they're not like crazy like summery beachy kind of colors but um it was fall and it was fall break for us so that i think is what i'm gonna do so let me step out of the way while julianne opens these super fun bags Ooh. Ooh, look at those so we got some wood veneer Hearts, I guess. I don't know what they are. And they're, they're like gold. They're actually chipboard. Oh. With a gold finish to them. They're very pretty. And then there's different uh, words like adore, blessed, and like brilliant and favorite and stuff like that. So that's in the first bag. And those are those puffy stickers I know are from the Truly Grateful collection. Colors match. So. And this is a heavy bag. I think there's a femra in it. There's a lot of ephemera. So it looks like it's a good combination of again and again and truly grateful. So this one says together and hello. Got some birds. A leaf. Yes. Another leaf. There's a lot going on here. This one says picture perfect. Happy place. That's perfect for Mexico, huh? Yeah. Hello, sunshine. Also perfect for Mexico. You are my sunshine. So there's this one, and this one, and this one says, see the beauty in everything. I think we can use this clock one for like time for the beach or something. Yeah. <laughs> Stay golden. This one says grateful. So that kind of looks like that is the ephemera. Almost everything from Truly Grateful except for that. Yeah. So that is the Truly Grateful ephemera. ephemera that we got. So go ahead and push that over to the side. This one are like is a bunch of like cards and stuff. So this is the ephemera from again and again or something close to it. This one says make your own magic. And they're just a bunch of fun little things. Ooh, airmail. I could use that for a picture of us on the plane. Oh, yeah. So up, up the, the sun. sun. Yeah. Captured. And this is two, so you, like, you can cut them or split them however you want, if you want to keep them or split them. Good things. This is also one that you can split up, as you can see here. This one you can split up or you can keep it together. It says life. A really cute fox. A beautiful floral. <clears throat> and then we have a bunch of different cards. I don't know if you can still see them. Yep, looks like you're all on screen. <clears throat> There's postcard. a postcard, That'll which is really perfect, cute. Huh? A little paper note thing. These are great for layering. 
I don't think we saw any owls. Owl. That might be a, a layering piece, huh? <laughs> yeah. Love all things good. Like a, what would you call this? Uh, it kind of looks like a piece of ledger. Like back in the day when it would print out like that. Like a note piece of paper. And the last one is says wonderful. And it's really pretty. So stay tuned to see what I end up making with this beautiful kit. My plan is to really kill this kit. Like I don't want a piece left of it because I have got to stop hoarding things. So we're going to stop hoarding this and we are going to make some awesome layouts. So make sure to wear your crown and give a big thumbs up. Bye. Bye.